Craigo. Do, do you ever get do you ever get tired of this? No, never. And the nicest thing is we've left the mountains behind. We've left a whole kind of hunting garden. And we're back on the coast. We're back into the coastal forest here. We're along the Indian Ocean. And uh, the terrain has changed. We're setting up, we're waiting, we're glassing. And we hope to spot in these little openings, we hope to spot bushbuck, hope to see a nyala maybe, see kudu, uh, see common like it, that, that kind of game. So er everything has changed. We're going to test the gun at a different level now. Things, something we haven't done up to this point. So I'm excited for today, um, hoping we can find ourselves a beautiful bushbuck tree. Well, Craig. Always a surprise when you're hunting down these coastal forests. Eh? Yeah, we are looking for bush, but and out steps a warthog down the clearing below us here. We know of a good old boar that, that, that likes living down here. Um, this particular pig I've spotted here, he, he, he's a fair boar, but he's not quite the one we've been, we, we've been seeing lately. So we're going to pass on him, but always surprises. Every corner there's a new game, you know, stepping out. You never know what to expect, eh? One of the things I love about coming to South Africa is you get to see all these animals that you just, you know, see at the zoo or see in a book, you know, I and mean, it's not every day you can walk down and see uh, mountain reed buck, you know, warthog, zebra, impala, kudu, this place is awesome. shooting in Africa you don't always need it I've just been looking at a little area below us here and looking for a bush buck ram I came around the bend and below us is a massive warthog feeding I'm telling you I really want to get this big so I don't know I don't know how long the shot's going to be this morning I know the gun can do it but it might not need to, need to do the long range this morning as long as it does a job for us let's try and put this big down he's a beauty let's go my man I love it when the pH gets excited I want you to hit him again. Okay. Going through the trees. Yeah! <laughs> he's running, he's running. Shoot. He's dead, man. Shoot. Well, how did that shot feel, Craig? Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. It looked good. I think I think the bullet's so fast. You see the way he was doing yeah. that? I think you've just gone right through him, you know, he's such a thin skinned animal. But I'm telling you, my man, 200 yard shot. We didn't, we didn't need all the gas we got in this gun. <laughs> but I tell you what, that pig is a pig and a half. It's a pig and a half. It is a magnificent auto. Bonga did a hell of a job for us. He was dead. You, you, the gun first, he did one hell of a job for us. Blew out that bottom part of the chest there. Um, so the gun does the trick once again. But then Bonga had a nice little exciting morning. Hey? You, you guys haven't given him much work with his guns at all. It's only fair that he did a little follow up. Hey? Beautiful war talk, my man. We 
Did it again, my man. Did it again. Did it again. <laughs> Beautiful warthog. Great start to our morning. The hunt is going to be unbelievable. Once they see this on see this form of footage, man, it's going to be unbelievable. Eh? Beautiful. That's all we do. That's all we do is put out good stuff that everyone likes to see, right? Dating. That's all we do. Beautiful. <laughs>